welcome back to the channel you guys today's episode is called 2k20 wishlist now you guys this clip that y'all seeing right here the screenshot is me actually running into a bug on my very final game in the playoffs so that's one thing that i want to make sure that doesn't happen in 2k20 you know we playing a video game let's say i'm in a match for 30 minutes to an hour and then all of a sudden I get a bug like that that is very very discouraging so 2k devs and Ronnie and Mike Wayne please go over that and handle it for us um not only that I am a 91 overall as y'all can see and I am a ball handling three-point sharpshooter at the bottom right of the screen y'all can uh, see my skill set and the reason why y'all are seeing this is because all of my skills all of my attributes will relate to the rest of this video so we're gonna be going over a couple of things not only that um, we have my badges all of my secondary badges are maxed out for my shooting and not only that I do feel like all of my shooting badges should have went gold you know I don't think I should have hit Hall of Fame for my shooting badges but especially my deep range dead eye that should be silver bro like I'm a three-point shooter bro a three-point shooter and if I hit 99 overall why not give me a gold badge and uh, I do got shots at the end um, well video clips at the end of me shooting certain things also as y'all can see I played 82 games now if I wouldn't have made my first player which is a sharpshooter shot creator he's like 6'2 or I should have made him 6'4 because I can't defend in the paint so I said the paint the paint whatever you want to call it so that's why I made this build instead so I could just be a little bit bigger and get blocks and stuff and right here man y'all can see the kid is going crazy with the Minnesota Timberwolves I kind of want that mascot if I if I do come back and play this and reach that now look at this dunk bro look at that dunk I posterize him I feel like I should always get that animation when I'm moving fast and look at this I'm literally about to dunk from the free throw line this is incredible Ronnie please please make this possible for ball handlers especially people with high acceleration speed just like Jordan bro he was a ball handling sharpshooter you know what I'm saying and he or a shot creator and look at look at this bro I'm about to break his neck I feel like we should have dribble tutorials on like what moves could break somebody ankles and not only that I have a goal ankle breaker and I don't care what player I'm playing against with a goal ankle breaker and my ball handling being at like a 86 or something I think I should literally be able to break somebody ankles and they should not be able to recover that fast and it would make my build lethal and I feel like it would be fair if I'm able to trigger those animations by doing certain moves especially if another player is reacting to that so no more bugs you know while playing the game not only that uh, the ankle breaker animation being able to run and dunk on people pump fake them and look look how he recovered boom dunked on him bro that's how it should always be standing dunk which is very very good um, y'all let me know what y'all think about these clips and the animations I'm talking about so look at this broke his ankles BAM he fell Wop. he didn't have no time to to contest that shot which is good and you see how I went behind my back on that clip and I just dunked it usually you get like this type of animation and I like this right here I would get blocking fouls for doing this but look I'm able to bump him okay and put pressure on him like real life not a foul I'm just checking him so we need more animation like that to where we're able to check players not only that look I should have got a block right here which bugs me so bad because we're dang near the same height same arm length the weight does not matter but at this point in time in real life if you jump at the same time as somebody and you know where they are you know where the ball is you know you're gonna get a block so I feel like we should be getting blocks according to our skill according to our player height and arm length um let's see what happens right here right here I caught a foul because of a steal this is Tom you know I've been playing the game since Nintendo I've been playing video games since Nintendo and I know a person weakness let me fix my hat baby you know what I'm saying ball cap K 
KG in the building. Not only that, look at this pass, bro. There's no way that we could stop that. We need a way to be able to stop that. Not only that, my teammate, we he doubled him, which is the AI. And he caught a foul for that. A pure clean steal. And that's a foul. 2K, y'all got to stop calling blocking fouls when body checking. Y'all got to stop... Um, 2K devs, y'all gotta stop that body body checking somebody and getting a uh, blocking foul is crazy. I'm not using circle, you know what I'm saying, to set a screen, so that shouldn't be illegal because th that's what basketball used to be about, bro. It used to be body contact, not like football, but just that. Look, he's so sour. I just like ruined a whole career bro i beat them four games in a row it's nothing and i do play on pro you guys it's worth playing on pro and y'all will see why um just from everything i got now look at this dog i'm hitting shots i'm hitting layups why can't i play like this in park you know pure skill bro good old floater bang i'm dropping bangers on these guys heads man um y'all talk to me in the comments man y'all let me know what y'all think about this wish list man so yeah, man, being able to body check the AI or anybody appropriately and not catching a foul. And then a proper steal should not be called as a foul, bro. Like, that's something that needs to be fixed. Not only that, I won the playoffs, the finals. Now, with winning the finals, right? They gave me this little trophy. like, And that, that's my dog right there, man. What is his name? A Anthony Davis or something like that? That's my dog. You know what I'm saying? You need a good center, bro. If you don't have a good center, you are lost. And right here, you guys, um, and I will get back to the trophy thing. Um, as y'all can see, it's gonna the clip is going to slow down. 29,000. Now, I simulated the rest of that game, okay, because I did not want to run into that bug again. I was like, third quarter, we went in the fourth quarter. I was like, I don't care about this extra VC and stuff. Just give me my dang dub, bruh. So, as y'all can see, I'm walking back to my locker room, and the coach is going to talk to me um, about the trophy and stuff, which is really cool. I think the story mode should not end after you leave the prelude. You know what I'm saying? It should keep going. And not only that, my rival, man, I like going against him. I like trash talking against him. And it was a good feeling to have somebody just as good as me or, or not better and be able to go back and forth with them in the NBA. So, 2K devs, man, keep the story going, bro. Um, it do like an expansion pack, you know what I'm saying? For later on, that would be nice, that would be more content for us YouTube developers. So, with that being said, you guys, so I got a trophy, I won the playoffs, but you want to know what I didn't get? I didn't get a dang ring. And as y'all can see, Shaq is on the screen, and every other player that I've in interacted with, you know, texting back with him, um, they keep talking about a three peat or a four peat. Even when I do that, we should get special rings for reaching certain achievements that, you know, park players can't get. You know, me playing 83 games, that's some dedication, bro. You know, I deserve a trophy and a ring to actually put on my player. And I think I went to the menu to see if I may have had a ring. So, yes, we need rings. We need proper calls when we're body checking people in the game. We need, um, what is it called? The right dunks. Uh, not calling um, fouls on a proper steal, you know? And not only that, I don't even be spamming square, but I still get a foul. Or my player goes crazy and he starts tussling with the, with the, the guy that has the ball, you know, wrestling him. That's not cool. So as y'all can see, I'm going in. I'm looking for my rings. There's no ring. There are my trophies, but we need rings in 2K20. Please, Ronnie, make it happen, bruh. That's all I'm asking for. So right here, you guys, that is a good shot. Someone from the channel said, man, we should get, we should get good releases, bro. I'm a sharpshooter, bruh. I should be making those automatically, bro. What's wrong with that shot? Nothing. Now, this is the same type of shot, but it says late. That's not true. My bar was dang near full. That was a perfect release, but it just didn't greet me. Like I said, the, look, same thing. The game, and, and don't, I don't want to hear nobody talking about your feet wasn't set, your feet wasn't set. That's BS. Look, same shot, same thing early, and it goes in. It should say good release. 
every time. That's a good release. It's not early. So um, skills, man. 2K devs. Mike Wayne, Ronnie, please base the game off of skill when it comes to blocks, when it comes to steals, when it comes to shooting. So when it comes to 2K19, 2K devs, Ronnie, Mike Wayne, all we wanted since 2K18 was three-point shooters and shot creators to be able to make mid shots and three-point shots, not for gl pure glass cleaners and post-scoring centers and, or power forwards hitting threes especially if you don't have a three-point archetype bruh if you have no three-point badges you should not be able to make three-point shots and that's just me excuse me you guys for burping um i do be snacking and stuff while i'm gaming so hey you're gonna catch a couple burps here and there but um with that being said man i hope y'all enjoyed this content i don't want to keep reiterating everything i just talked about so hopefully i explained everything the best way i could to get my point across and uh yeah with that being said y'all already know what i'm about to say man until next time i will talk to y'all when i talk to y'all matter of fact i will see y'all when i see y'all in the next live stream upload fire food vlog maybe another shoebox unboxing and i'm getting back into you know retro jordan so y'all make sure y'all tune into the channel if y'all want to see me opening up more shoes but with that being said Deuces.